It's nothing creepy. <laughs> Please state your name for the folks at home when I tap you on the shoulder. Kate. Amber. Kate, Amber, what do you do for a living? Nothing. That would explain why you're on Twitter <laughs> all day begging to be on the Tootsie Fruits show all day. I've been trying to, I was trying to look up my tweets to see what was going on in the tweet land thing and all day you've been asked to be on the show. Why? I'm a big fan of the show. Honestly, I didn't think it would work. I really didn't think this through. I'm kind of ashamed no, of myself well, now. But not thinking things through tells me you're just the kind of person we need here. Yeah? <laughs> you're going to fit right in. What are you girls, where, well, where are you girls from? Originally Detroit, Michigan. I've been there. Yeah. I'm still from there. Okay. It's true. <laughs> it's true. Well, where, where are you from now? I live in New Orleans. Okay. That's nice. Yeah. yeah. How is it? Is it all right? I love it. Yeah. No, no, no. I meant after the thing, you know, the storm, the big storm. Is everything okay? Everything's okay, yeah. Oh, okay. Great. Everybody's got power back. It's, it's awesome. Oh, well, take that, news. <laughs> So, um, what do you do down there, apart from tweeting me all day? Um, nothing so far. Okay. I'm gonna do you look... have any ambitions, uh, something you'd like to do? Yeah, I want to be a writer. Ah, uh, writer, eh? Yeah. What, in television? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> You're already too good. Uh, <laughs> same for you? No. What do you want to do? Um, I want to, well, I like what I do right now, which is I just hang around with the... Uh, Chinese college students. <laughs> hey, well, I guess somebody's got to do it. Uh, that's that. That's an actual. That's a job. Yes. Right. <laughs> what, what do you call that job? Um, it's a nonprofit. We. Oh, yeah, I them. can imagine. Yeah. <laughs> I got it. Got it. Where's the big money? Oh, well. We show them Michigan. Oh, mm -hmm. well, that's great. <laughs> it's nice, Michigan. I, I've, I've always enjoyed it. I like it, too. Well, so much you moved to New Orleans. Absolutely. <laughs> All right, well, now you've been on the show, has, the, has it been demystified for you? Um, it's been wonderful. Thank Good. you. Let me just, uh, excuse me just a second. I just, you... Because I put them on the show for annoying me on Twitter, that doesn't mean that I'm ever going to do it ever again for anyone else. We'll be right back, everybody. We'll be right back. That looked tired and pissed off to you. Okay, good. Please state your name for the folks at home. My name is Mitchell. Mitchell! That's a lovely name. You seem like a personable young man. What are you doing right now, Mitchell, in your life? I'm interning for you. Oh, you're an intern at the show here, huh? Mitchell, if I... Uh, you know I have young children, Mitchell, don't you? Right. Right, right. I, I got a, I got a two-year-old in the house. He's kind of... I don't know what's going on with him right now, but he's keeping me awake all night. I'm very, very tired. So when I came to work today, Mitchell, I, I said to everyone, Hey, I, look, I, to, Liam kept me up all night. I'm going to go to my office take a nap. Um, and it was cool, and I was having a nap. What happened, Mitchell? I was the one who knocked. You knocked on my door, Mitchell! <laughs> Was it an emergency, Mitchell? No, not at all. It was not an emergency, Mitchell. What was it, Mitchell? I like to give little autographed cups to the guests when they arrive at the show, right? Right. When did they get here? About five minutes before the show? When did you knock on my door, Mitchell? 11 a.m., Mitchell. <laughs> and I don't want to freak you out, because I, yeah. you know, people think that I'm being unreasonable. I'm not being unreasonable. I just want a, you know, I, you, you're, nothing's going bad's going to happen. Okay. <laughs> If you don't do it again. Okay. But you have to remember the lesson of what happened. Like, remember when, you don't know about this, before you got here, Bridger, who was an intern, he crashed my car. <laughs> Bridger, can you come out here?
It's just kind of a warning, Mitchell, you know what I'm saying? I'm You're, sorry. That's all right, sorry. It's all right. You're not as sorry as Bridger. You all right, you all right, buddy? Yeah. Nearly done, only two more weeks and we're good. <laughs> we'll be right back, everybody, we'll be right back. Oh, we started? Right. <laughs> good evening, ladies. Please state your name for the folks at home when I touch you on the shoulder. Caroline is my name. Caroline is your name. Johanna. Johanna. You girls from out of town? <laughs> yes. Where are you from? Germany. Oh, really? Germany? <laughs> there were three of you a minute ago. What happened to the... We lost one. You lost one of your friends. Doesn't want to be... Or here. Are you here working or on a mission? I mean, uh, I... Uh, yeah. um, vacation. Vaca are you on vacation? That's what I meant. I am on vacation. You're on vacation. What are you doing here? Now? I study. You study? What are you studying? Business and management of entertainment. The business and management of entertainment? Right. Well, you've come to the wrong... I don't play. <laughs> That's what I realized too late. No. Hey, um, what town in Germany are you from? Gießen. <laughs> you don't know Gießen? I do know Gießen a little. Isn't that where the geese are from? <laughs> Close no. to Frankfurt. Close to Frankfurt? I have been to Frankfurt. To the airport. Yes. See? How did you know? Yeah. Everybody has to be. Do you recognize me? Maybe. Maybe. Wait, are you from Gießen too? Yes. Oh, that's... We're sisters. Are you? Yeah. Couldn't you tell? Oh, yeah. <laughs> This is kind of going in a direction which is working for me, actually. I have to, uh... Well, ladies, we would like to welcome you to America. I hope you enjoy your studies here and your vacation. And uh, CBS has a present for you. Beth, why don't you bring out their present? Beth is a CBS executive. She could probably help you in your, uh, mm -hmm. in your um, work to know about business. <laughs> come on, oh, come on! <laughs> Hell! <laughs> Beth is a CBS executive, aren't you, Beth? Yes, I am. You have been awarded dinner for two at Craig's Restaurant. It's not my actual restaurant. It's a restaurant called Craig's. It's got nothing to do with me. A bit like your friend has got nothing to do with you two. <laughs> whoa, whoa! <laughs> what the... I feel the same. Turn my back and just walk away? I could sense the dirty and I just wanted to go market on the strike. Can you sense the dirty now? <laughs> sense the dirty, baby. Sense the dirty. <laughs> Diners, drive-ins and dives. Please state your name for the folks at home when I gesture toward you. Susan. Susan. Linda. Linda. Kevin. Kevin. Are you three related in any way? Yes. <laughs> Tell me, where are you from? Iowa. Iowa. How do you pass away the long evenings at home in Iowa? Uh, drink. Drink, really? <laughs> After you've had a couple of drinks, you start thinking to yourself, Hey, I've had a great idea. Let's dye our hair the same color. <laughs> now, I'm guessing that there was some lady beauty treatments going on. You were a little buzzed up, and you're like... That's what happened, isn't it? You Got were like, drunk. Oh, yeah. come on, then! Ah. Go for it. Yeah. That's how I got my breast implants. <laughs> so, uh, what do you guys do? Are you, uh, you, you're all um, living in the same house? We're married. You're married? Yeah. It's my sister from California. Oh, you're from California? I'm from Southern California. Oh, so your hair is naturally that color. Uh, yeah. <laughs> you moved to California? Yes. So you'll be the vegan liberal of the family? I am. <laughs> Uh -oh. 
So, uh, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. <laughs> so, what part of Iowa do you live in? Des Moines. Des Moines. I've been there. Yeah. They've got that. Uh, that. What's the name of that theater there? Civic Civic Theater. Sure. Yeah. <laughs> No, you don't, you don't go to the theater much, do you? No. Nah. Nah, nah. We had to pay to go there. Yeah, yeah. Let, let me guess. It was your idea to come here to this show tonight. It was, yes. Yeah. We couldn't get on Ellen. Yeah. Oh. He didn't say that. No, I think that's fair. I mean, I can tell by your style you're drawn to that kind of a thing. Anyway, we were doing the Christmas card. I thought you guys would be great for oh. it. <laughs> we'll be right back. <laughs> the girls of Lesbian Row, everybody. <laughs> Craig, why? Why have you brought up the girls of lesbian role? Come on! Well, I'll tell you why, because tonight it's international lesbian role. <laughs> we have girls from... France. France! Sweden. <laughs> France. Do you know each other? Yes. <laughs> That's awesome. And where are you from, young international lady? Orange County! <laughs> That's fine. So, um, France, eh? What part of France are you from? Paris. Oh, we've been there. We went there. Jeff and I went to Paris. Oh, yeah? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> Which part of Paris? Uh, 5e arrondissement. Oh, wait! <laughs> Where are you from? Sweden. Well, you, which part? Like Malmo? Ish. Like Malmo is? Yeah, like a really small village called Palestine. Is that the place where the uh, the thing happened with the, the dragon tattoo thing? <laughs> no. no. <laughs> <laughs> You're from also uh, Paris? Yes. I like to pretend that I don't speak English very well to people whose English isn't their first language, so it helps me feel included. <laughs> and which part of Orange County are you from, my young American friend? The boring part? <laughs> You're gonna have to be more specific, I'm afraid. Fountain Valley. What valley? Fountain Valley. Yes. <laughs> well, ladies, I've got a special surprise for you. Secretariat, come on out, would you? <laughs> ladies, please meet the legendary American racehorse Secretariat. <laughs> <laughs> it was a little jumpy in the back. <laughs> We're going to send you to a fabulous Hollywood restaurant. Where are we sending them? The Ivy. The Ivy. It's a famous Hollywood. And you go for free. <laughs> on one condition. Oh, no. If you can dance Gangnam style <laughs> with my horse and me. your name for the folks at home when I point at you in an accusing manner? Abby. Abby? Uh-huh. Oh, how lovely. And you are? <laughs> Suzanne. Suzanne. Oh. Where are you from, ladies? Brighton. Brighton, England? Yes. Where are you from? From London. Oh. <laughs> it's like Downton Abbey already, is there? <laughs> Holiday here? Yes. I say holiday because that's how English people say vacation. <laughs> Have you seen any lorries or bought any petrol? <laughs> <laughs> Are you having a nice time? Yes. Yes. yes? Uh, what have you seen? Everything. <laughs> no, you haven't. <laughs> no, you haven't. Are you touring America or just doing Los Angeles? Just Los Angeles. I see. And uh, what business are you in uh, back home? Uh, we both just graduated from university. <laughs> Wait, whoa, 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 whoa. You don't know what their grades were. Shut up. <laughs> Did you do well? Yeah. Okay, good. <laughs> Knock it off. <laughs> Save your enthusiasm for the monologue.
Punk, you're gonna need it. <laughs> so, uh, how long are you here for? Two uh, weeks. Two weeks. Mm, all right. What are you gonna do in your jobs now that you've graduated? <laughs> Don't know. <laughs> well, what, are, what did you study? History. Oh. <laughs> I see. <laughs> Any particular period in history you enjoyed? 20th century. That's history? I was born. <laughs> I was born in the 20th century. <laughs> what, what part of the 20th century? The World Wars, all that stuff? Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. That was a bad business. <laughs> 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 the most definitive description of the World Wars available. That was a bad business. <laughs> well, uh, we've got a surprise for you. <laughs> Where are we sending them for dinner? Craig's. Craig's restaurant? I have a restaurant in Los Angeles. <laughs> but it's called Craig's and it's actually good. <laughs> Do you eat meat? Uh-huh. Yeah. We'd like to send you two girls and both parts of Secretariat. <laughs> no, actually, uh, we'll send you and the horse uh, to, to Craig's restaurant, where they serve exclusively horse meat. <laughs> they don't. They don't! No, it's a joke. They don't serve horse meat. Do they? No, they don't. That's not even <laughs> The French do that. You know what? 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 Is it? Are we out of time? I'd rather I was just beginning to enjoy myself. <laughs> Do you often laugh when you're nervous, then? <laughs> <laughs> Is one of you neat and one of you untidy and you share an apartment? <laughs> uh, I can have your sitcom on CBS, then. <laughs> we'll be right back. <laughs> well, wait, wait, wait. Glasses or no glasses? No glasses. You want me to take them? Yeah. I'll put them next to the robot. <laughs> All right, you ready? Yeah. All right, just pretend it never started yet. All right, you ready? All right. Please state your name for the folks at home. Margo. Margo, you say? Margo, I see you're wearing a red dress. Yes, sir. That would imply you're a prostitute. <laughs> Is that true? No. Oh, thank goodness. It would have been awkward if you were like, how did you guess? <laughs> What do you do for a living, Margo? Um, I work at a theme park in Anaheim. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. We, we can't say the name of it for, for legal reasons, but... Exactly. <laughs> oh, boy. <laughs> oh, that's so great. <laughs> so, at this uh, so-called theme park <laughs> slash nightclub slash bar... Um, <laughs> What, what, what do you do there? Can you say? Or is it, um, no, you probably not, right? We work at attractions. You work at attractions? Yeah. How do you attract people there? Um. Wear your red dress, right? Eh? I tell jokes on a boat. You tell Can jokes? You tell jokes? Yeah. Not good ones, just jokes. <laughs> do you have a joke dance? Yeah. Um. We do a joke, a, a dance here. Whenever we do a joke, not good ones, don't worry. <laughs> We do a little dance. Okay. Do you, you want to you wanna do it with me? Do you got the joke dance? Well, maybe we should tell a joke first. Okay. All right. You go first. No, you go first. <laughs> I don't think I can say any of the jokes. We, are, are you are we talking about the same place in Anaheim? Yes. Because I think I might have missed this attraction when I was there. No. All right. Well, we'll just... Uh, Jeff, you got a joke? No, uh, no, hell no. All right, then. <laughs> Well, we'll just have to imagine a joke, like we do every night. So, we'll imagine a joke has happened, and what happens then? Yeah, you got, there you go. There you are. That's right there. Do you want to take your flip-flops you. off? No, that's okay. All right. <laughs> Good evening, everyone. Don't, don't, 
please, no sudden moves. <laughs> Hi, young lady, what's your name? Stephanie. Stephanie? Anything planned for the next <laughs> few days? I certainly hope so. Yeah. How, how, uh, how pregnant are you? Well, I mean, you get pregnant and then you stay pregnant, if you know what I mean. But <laughs> when are you expecting your baby? Two days ago. Two days ago? <laughs> Could be a big show tonight. <clears throat> have you ever delivered a baby before? I have, in fact, delivered two babies. Really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I'll be fine. I, okay. I know what I'm doing. Okay. Um, Perfect. Is this your first baby? It is. Okay. <laughs> first, first one's always late. First one, they say the first one. Do you know what you're having yet? Do you know? It's a boy. It's a boy. Congratulations. That's. Uh, Thank you. Wait, wait, wait. What are you doing? What are you doing? Would you have booed if it was a girl? No, if it's a boy or a girl, either way, it's great. Are you very excited? Very. Yes. Yeah, yeah. You getting any sleep? Not much. No. no. And that will continue for the rest of your life. Exactly. So I've been told. Yeah, it's all right though. Do people did people come up and touch your belly when you were pregnant? No, actually, I they got didn't? lucky with that. Yeah. So if I did it, I'd be the first. You would. Can can I? Sure. No, I don't. <laughs> I don't know do. Is the is the baby moving right now? No. No. It's probably sleeping through the show the same way. <laughs> same way that I do, most nice. <laughs> have you decided on a name at all? Uh, we have. Do you want to keep it quiet? Do you uh, no, we can say it. All right. Uh, Craig Ferguson Gordon. Craig Ferguson Gordon? <laughs> That's not true, is it? No. <laughs> no, that, you'd be dooming the poor kid to a life of ridicule. But what, uh, you, you have to say a name, but you are keeping it quiet. Uh, no, it's Connor. Connor, that's a lovely name. And and where uh, where do you live? Uh, Mar Vista. Oh, that's the place. <laughs> <laughs> Still on the street away. Yeah. So uh, two two days two days ago, your yeah, baby was due. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Could be any I just, minute. I, I know. That's what I'm thinking. If you sit here long enough. <laughs> Could be looking at a rating spike, yeah. <laughs> or at least a YouTube moment. I'm thinking. <laughs> they say that uh, laughter uh, induces. Well, then I came to the right place. <laughs> no, you did not. <laughs> well, uh, we'll take a commercial break, and when we come back, uh, there could be another member of the studio audience. <laughs> Good evening, everyone. I don't know if you know this, but last night Stephanie was here and uh, her baby was two days late and uh, here we are again. <laughs> How you, any, any kind of uh, movement in the last 24 hours? Any of the, uh, Unfortunately, no. Nothing at all, eh? You know, there's a place in the valley, they say there's this restaurant you can go to the valley and if you have this special salad, it, it, it brings on, uh, you know, Contractions. Really? Yeah. So they say. Uh, I've I've done it uh, a couple of times. So it, does it work? No, it doesn't work at all. But I, <laughs> but it gives you something to do while you're waiting. Because it's the waiting must be tough. But listen, we all got together uh, because you know at Connor, you're going to call your little boy, right? And we thought uh, we'd give him a, a present, and it's a book about ancient Egypt. <laughs> um, you know, because uh, I, you know, I, you, I've got a couple of kids. You're you're just getting started, and um, I have to say that the kids love ancient Egypt. <laughs> Can't get enough of it. You're, there's going to be a lot of ancient Egypt in your future from now on. <laughs> no, I think they like the uh, you know the, the the hats with the snakes on them. Right. Uh, they like that, and then there's the thing at the back, which is kind of funny. This is kind of when your kid gets a little older, you think that's funny. You know, the holding the balls, you know. <laughs> Now listen, you're going to have a little boy. Yes. Right, so do you like fart jokes? <laughs> you should meet my husband. <laughs> is your husband here? He is. Yeah, where, where is he then? Is that... Oh, hey, hey, what's up? Hi. Hi. You should, you should probably come down. No, no, stay there. Uh, <laughs> So I'm glad that you wore your uh, your rain jacket, though. Uh, do you feel more comfortable with big clothing? Is that? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 
I mean, it all, you know, when you get, well, after you have the baby, don't go crazy, you know, trying to, uh, you know, drop weight and all that, because a lot of women do that, and it, you'll make yourself sick. Just take it easy. Okay. Take it easy. Take it easy. I'll do my best. Yeah. <laughs> Although you don't look like you're carrying a lot of weight, to be honest. It's all baby. Thank you. No, I'm just yeah, saying. Thank you. I know how to talk to pregnant women. <laughs> Uh, I, I know how to, to get. Never mind. Uh, <laughs> so I'm very excited for you, though. Uh, you got you got we got him started in his career in Egyptology. Thank little, you so much. Little corner, uh, <laughs> uh, and that's from all the folks here at CBS. We all put uh, our money together, <laughs> and we're going to send you to a very nice restaurant as well. You and your husband. Where are we sending them? The Ivy. The Ivy? Wow. Now listen, the Ivy, they, they got this salad in the Ivy. And if you order... <laughs> no, it's, it's actually it's a very nice restaurant and very expensive. And here's what I want you to do, because uh, CBS are going to pick up the tab. Like, you can't drink, obviously, but your husband can. <laughs> okay. You know, and maybe you can get some stuff to go. <laughs> what I'm saying is stack the bill a little. Okay. You know what I mean? Stack the bill. Don't be shy. Oh, we going? Yeah. Oh, sorry, right. <laughs> when I tap you on the shoulder, please state your name for the folks at home. Vicky. What? Vicky. Vicky? Yes. I thought you said Figgy. <laughs> Figure. <laughs> Michelle. Oh, I thought you said Figgy. <laughs> Kathy. Kathy. Vicky, Michelle, and Kathy. Do you girls all hang out together? Uh, we, no. yeah, just in, yeah, just right there. <laughs> so, you don't know each other? No, no. well, we do. We're travelling to. We do. Wait, 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 where are you from? Australia via London. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Australia? No, London, London, really. Well, um, and uh, where are you from, Vicky? Houston. Texas? Yeah. Come sit by me. <laughs> mm. In my experience, it doesn't hurt to have a Texan between you and some Australian. <laughs> Well, it's true. <laughs> so, uh, what part of Australia are you from, ladies? Queensland. Oh, Crocodile Dundee land. That's up north with the crocodiles and the things. Yeah, we're always sort of down the bottom. You're at the bottom of Queensland? Like near, near, Gold, near the Gold Coast. What, Brisbane? Yes. Yeah. yeah. I can't believe I got that right! <laughs> That's great! Yeah. Thanks, everybody. <laughs> now, would it be fair to say, then, that Brisbane is kind of the Houston, Texas of Australia. Yes. <laughs> In a way, it's a big town, it's a modern city, it's got uh, a lot of killer spiders. It does, actually. Yeah. yeah. Do you have any killer spiders in Houston? No. You may want to think about changing that. <laughs> now, the Australians are really pulling ahead of you there in the, in the killer spider thing. So, um, here's my question. Um, do I have a question? <laughs> Yes, I do. You're traveling through America. Mm -hmm. uh, and you've come to Los Angeles. Have you been to Texas yet? No, we're going. Oh, yeah, you'd like it. Yeah, I think we will. No, Australians yeah. love Texas. It's we, we love LA. We don't, I don't want to leave LA. I love it. <laughs> How long have you been here? A few days. A few days. Uh, yeah. uh, have you been here for. You're not here visiting. Are you visiting? Um, business. 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 What kind of business you in? Um, facilities. Facilities. <laughs> Import export. Know what I'm saying? <laughs> hey, you didn't see nut. <laughs> facilities, eh? <shall I? laughs> well, ladies, we have a surprise for you. Be very, very quiet. <laughs> the entire row of lesbian row tonight <laughs> are from Denmark. As you can tell by their good looks and blonde hair. Most of them. Get out, you're not from Denmark. My Denmarking friends, welcome to America. Who speaks the best English here? I imagine you all speak English pretty good. 
Uh, English, everybody's good at it? Mm, not maybe. Okay. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> All right, dude. You speak Danish? I do, yes. Good. Mm -hmm. What's the Danish word for lesbian? Uh, lib. <laughs> As I see. So, uh, and when you're uh, thinking about, if someone was to say, well, look, this is Lebro here. Yeah. Dude. Lebro? Yes. You're sitting in Lebro. Uh, okay. <laughs> okay. Okay. Swiss, 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 Swiss. Well, this is not going to work now. I, I, I was concerned because your friend, who is clearly genetically male, <laughs> was sitting in lesbian row, which is a great insult to our American ways of thinking. I realise that he doesn't mean it, but we're uh, shockingly upset. I'm sorry. He's sorry. Ah, well, that's good enough for me. Uh, so, uh, Denmarkanians? Denska. 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 Mm -hmm. Oh, I enjoy your margarine. <laughs> Why are you in Los Angeles? We are on a holiday. All of you together? Yeah. Mm -hmm. what, what, why? <laughs> Wait, what do you do? How do you all know each other? Are you, is it a reality show? No. <laughs> well, how do you know each other? We went to school together and he's my boyfriend. <gasps> no, oh. girlfriend, sorry. No, no, yeah. I get it. <laughs> I've just had an idea. We will have a competition, uh, and the competition is this: if you can, uh, I like he, he right. You come over here, right? No, you like, yeah, come on, yeah, right. right come over. Here. Now I'm going to ask you a thing, and then if you get them right, we'll sit, we'll give you a prize. Uh, if he can get it, like the old uh, match, uh, the Holly, you know the game, right? Okay, I can't. Right, so here's the game: uh, when you and your boyfriend are on a train, don't listen. <laughs> Does he like to face the way the train's going, face the way the train, away from the train, or does he not care? He doesn't care. All right. <laughs> <laughs> Don't stand in front of your girlfriend <laughs> when you're on a train. What's your name? Uh, Tobias. And you are? Sabrina. <laughs> are you guys vampires? <laughs> <laughs> a little bit. When you're on a train, do you like to face the way you're going, or no, uh, do you, or don't you care? Uh, the way I'm going. Oh, hell? That's not even possible. You can hear. Congratulations, you won a prize. Here's what the prize is. I've had a great idea. CBS is going to send all of them, Lincoln Berry, all of them, to uh, that restaurant. What one is it? The, I the Ivy? Yeah, the expensive one. Send them all to the Ivy. And you guys gonna pay? Sure. Look, yeah. <laughs> Welcome to America. We'll be right back, everybody. Please state your name for the folks at home. Uh, I'm Jay Lee. Jay, eh? Yeah. Good name for late night. Thanks. Where are you from, Jay Lee? I'm from Saratoga, California. Saratoga, California. Saratoga, California. That's where they have the sparkling water. I did learn about that in my AP US history class, yeah. It's like, there was this big contention. Let it go, okay, let it go. Word on the YouTubes and the uh, face tweets is that, uh, is that you know how to uh, gang them pretty good. I, I can gang them pretty good, yeah. What, what did you say? Gang them. <laughs> Korea number one. <laughs> uh, well. thinking there's gonna be a dance-off. <laughs> you ready? I'm ready.
Well, if I became Prime Minister of Australia, I would never allow cats to throw uh, boomerangs at little beautiful mice. <laughs> Very good. Oh, hello, young lady. What's your name? My name's Jill. Where are you from, Jill? I'm from Queensland, Australia. <laughs> and you, sir, what's your name? I'm David, and I'm from Queensland, Australia. Oh, Jill and David from Queensland. Yeah. See, it's working. They're beginning to come. It's <laughs> uh, you guys uh, know who's the Prime Minister of Australia right now? Uh, a redhead lady called Julia Gillard. Yeah, any good? No. <laughs> so, uh, who else is good down there at the Prime Ministering? Anybody right now? At the Prime Ministering right now, yeah. I reckon you would be the better one. Well, I don't know. <laughs> No, would you guys embrace the idea of uh, an American immigrant and his gay robot pal as to, <laughs> to run your country? Crikey, that would be just ripper. <laughs> Absolutely. Wait, 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 wait. What did she, what did she say? She said that would be awesome. Ah. <laughs> Thank you very much indeed. Well. Your accent's very good too, I meant to say that. Your accent's really good, really good, mate. I didn't understand that. What did she say? Uh, <laughs> she, she says your accent's really good. Oh, right. And when you go to Australia and you're Prime Minister, mm -hmm. right, um, the women are Sheilas and they're the blokes. So mate's the thing, but if you have another Australian up here, you say, well, you're a ripper Sheila, mate. <laughs> you got all that? This is getting a little more complicated now, for us, but I'll, I'll, I'll do my best dinkum dingy dingy out. Oh. <laughs> Say goodnight, my Australian friend. Goodnight. Good night. <laughs> when I tap you on the shoulder, please state your name for the folks at home. Oh, my name is uh, Jay Leno. <laughs> Jay Leno. Leno. Oh, yeah. Where are you from, Jay? Well, I'm originally from Boston. Boston, you say? All right. <laughs> Quiet, please. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> and uh, you on vacation here in California? Is that what you're doing, son? Well, yeah, since 72. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> You've been on vacation since 1972? <laughs> you know, it's one of those things you like it, and next one thing leads to another. Oh, that's what Jeff always says. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Have you met Jeff? I have. We, hello. Oh, hey, uh, Jay, uh, what was it? Leno. Leno, yeah. <laughs> Wait a minute. What are you reading there, Jeff? Why, it's Jay Leno's book. Wow. And, and thanks for getting such a good copy. Oh, wow. Look. Hey, wait a minute. Who the hell is this guy? <laughs> And I have black so, hair. Did, did you write this in 1972? Was I, that I, I, no, I wrote that in 96. All right, uh, I'm, yeah. gonna, I'm gonna read uh, a I'm passage. Read a passage. Wow, wait a minute, come on, man. You like that, you like Sexy. that? Sexy. Yeah. Yeah, look at that. Come yeah. on, I gotta, I gotta show them. Whatever well, turns you on. Look at that. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so, uh, right then. Want to hang around and be on the show? Yeah, sure. All right, okay, we'll see you in a minute. <laughs> <laughs> Do we have any Australians here this evening? Well, yes. Oh! <laughs> Hello, ladies. Hi. What are your names? I'm Grace. Grace and... Mary. Grace and Mary. Yes. Oh, you're Catholic girls. <laughs> <Yes. laughs> <laughs> didn't say anything. I didn't say anything. Uh, ladies, uh, which yes. part of Australia are you from? Melbourne. Melbourne, that's the bit that I like, yes. along with other parts of Australia. <laughs> I've been to Melbourne. Have you? Yeah, yeah, I've been down to St Kilda and Fitzroy and all around there. Nice. Yeah, it was, yeah. It was Ripper. <laughs> Anyway, here's the thing, ladies. I'm glad you're from Australia because um, last night on the show I talked about your Prime Minister, uh, Miss uh, Julia Gillard. Uh, yes. Yeah, and I said Gillard, uh. and I got a furious tweet from Australia today. Yeah. People were like, "Bongo dingies!" <laughs> 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 
Gary, it's not that, it's that. <laughs> and I felt terrible about it, so I'd like to apologise to you okay. uh, personally, and if you could take that back to Australia. Why are you here? <laughs> Are you on vacation? Yeah, yeah vacation. vacation. Oh, vacation. Holiday. Oh, great. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Holiday. <laughs> Holiday. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. Holiday. Aren't they strange? <laughs> yeah. You say holiday instead holiday. of vacation? Yeah. <laughs> are you having a nice time? Lovely, yeah. yes. Oh, good, good. Thank People you. being nice to you? Very nice. Americans are very pleasant, they are. aren't they? Yes, I like them. I, I'm one, in fact. I know. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I've been to Australia, though. I enjoyed it immensely, but not for a long time. Why? Well, I was drunk when I was there last time. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and some stuff happened. Yes. Okay. But the Prime Minister who was the Prime Minister there when I was there was a gentleman called Bob Hawke. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, that was a while ago. Yeah. That was a while ago. <laughs> 25 years ago, maybe. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> So, uh, he's not the Prime Minister anymore then? Oh. No. All right then. How is the one you've got, the uh, Miss, uh, Mrs. Miss? Gillard. Gillard. Gillard, yes. Gillard. She's all right. Is she? Yeah. She's doing all right. She's doing all right, John. No, um, yeah, good. I'm all not over getting a word of this. You getting any of this? <laughs> She's good. She yeah. fell over a couple of weeks ago. She fell that, over? That was really funny. Oh, bless her. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> political people. So. Oh, you want Australians or just you two? Uh, oh, I see. Australians are quite political though, aren't they? Probably, yeah. <laughs> Have you ever met any? Yeah, but yeah. yeah. <laughs> well, I think that's put the international incident to bed. <laughs> Thank you, girls from Australia, and as a special treat, we're going to send you to, where are we sending them? Craig's Restaurant. Craig's Restaurant, which has nothing to do with me. It's a restaurant called Craig's and it serves terrific food. Meat! Uh, yeah. Which, as uh, Australian uh, girls from Lesbian Row, I'm sure you'll enjoy. <laughs> very quickly, just very quickly. Do you notice that uh, in, in Australia, because it's in the Southern Hemisphere, their lesbians go around the other way? <laughs> We'll be right back. <laughs> quick, quick, quick. Run across there and check if they're friendly. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Welcome, young, unconventional people. Craig, we're frightened. <laughs> I know, I'm frightened too. <laughs> but what we're going to do is we're going to get to know our unconventional young people by asking them their names. They're not frightening. <laughs> What's your name, young fella? Figures. They're a little bit frightening. <laughs> Figures? That's all right, yeah. You an accountant? Ha ha ha! See you later! Figures, you an accountant! Do people say that all the time? Yeah. All the time? All the time. Oh, you're Australian. I am Australian. Get off! <laughs> I'm kidding. Which part of Australia are you from? Melbourne. I've been to Melbourne. Oh, do you like it? Yes, I do, actually. I've been down to St Kilda and I've been to Fitzroy. You're from St Kilda, aren't you? No, I hope not. No, why not? <laughs> if you come from St Kilda, you are usually either a walker of the night or... That's me. Oh, okay. <laughs> Go up to the end there. Hello, girls who were sitting in lesbian row. <laughs> Hello. Are you from Australia too? No, we're, ca we're Canadian. Yes. Good God. <laughs> All of you? I'm Mexican. You're Mexican? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> what happened? <laughs> Just, what are you doing? <laughs> I'm trying to get the folks at home not to be frightened of young people, and now you've just got them frightened of foreigners. <laughs> And I've been working for years to get them off that. <laughs> uh, what are you doing here, my Canadian friend, Mexican friends? <laughs> what are you doing here? We're on tour with our band. You're in a band? Yes. yes. <laughs> the three of us here. Yeah. We're all in the same band. And she's, and, and, and she's, and well. she's a musician too. But you just... <laughs> what? We're friends. We're all friends. What, are you like, like Scrappy-Doo or something? What the hell? 
They don't let you in the band, but you get to hang out? No, oh, it's right. yeah. <laughs> You don't need to take that. You're a Canadian citizen. Yeah. <laughs> I have, I have my own band. She has her own. Wait a minute, let me just check. Is there anyone here this evening who is not in a... I got a map band. <laughs> Figures, you're in a band, aren't you? I am. Yeah. We're... <laughs> Do, do, do not plug this band no, now, Figures. Please, do not do it. Please, we're a comedy rock band as well. We'll be right back, everybody. We'll be right back. <laughs> Please state your name for the folks at home. I'm DJ Qualls. Ah, DJ Qualls. Why are you here? Is it because The Last Twilight's coming out this week? It is. Oh, I love Twilight so much. I do too. Having never seen it, I'm really sad that it's the last one. I'm really sad too. <laughs> no, I am sad. I am. Sad. I thought you. it would have been better if you were in it, though. Me too. I look like a vampire. A little bit. I think I do. Well, the thing about vampires is, and I, and I hate to be mean. Uh, no, you don't. No, I don't, actually. <laughs> I kind of enjoy it. But, the, but vampires are kind of, they're very, very cool, and sometimes when you spill a drink on your pants, that's not that cool. Right, 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 right. But you are cool. I'm definitely cool. You're very cool. Look, you've got a, you're thin, you've got skinny leg suits, you've got the, the Converse, high tops or low? They're uh, low tops. I bought this off a mannequin at H&M today. I'm the right size. <laughs> I'm mannequin size. I didn't know until today. So you can get uh, models exactly like you that are inanimate? Exactly. <laughs> Wait. Is that a, that's a creepy thing, yeah, that really. That is kind of creepy. Yeah. So what else? Not much, really. I've got to do the show tonight. Do I get a mug and a t-shirt for this? <laughs> yeah, yeah, from Lano. Sure. <laughs> I don't want one from Leno. Oh, come on, Leno's great. Yeah, he, Leno's great. He is great. He I is like great. him. He's, you know what he's got? He's got the car collection. You want to get a car collection? I do. Yeah, how many cars have you got? I have one. I have a That's pathetic. I know, right? I have a 10-year-old car. 10-year-old car? It's 40,000 miles on it, though. I can't get rid of it. What kind of car is it? Don't say the brand. Just say the type of car it is. It's a German car. Oh, I see. <laughs> <laughs> This car, is it three letters or is it sort of the name of maybe some hipster daughter? Hipster daughter car. Hipster daughter, so yes. it is. Oh, uh, yes, uh, hands this over here to me, will you please? There you are. This is the t shirt from Thank the show. You. Here's Why the... do you guys always do this? Have you met me? I get the same size t shirt every time I come here. And it always looks like that. The mug, I have like 14 of them. I love it. Yeah. That. But this is unacceptable. We're friends. You know me. Yeah, but you look cute when you sleep in it. <laughs> We're right back, everybody. No. Abraham and Emily, I believe. Abraham, where are you from? I'm from Perth, Western Australia. Perth, Western Australia. I believe that's what he said. I don't speak the language. <laughs> Emily, where are you from? Um, Northern Minnesota. An American girl. Ooh, yeah, all right. Take it easy, baby. This could last all night. <laughs> <laughs> I hope so. Wait, wait, what were you talking about? Anyway, look, Abraham was sitting in Lesbian Row, and uh, he doesn't know our ways. He doesn't know our ways. He just innocently sat, unless, no, you're, uh, you're, you're, no. Uh, so, um... Well, maybe a little bit. Well, I, I get it. What, what are you doing in America? Uh, just a week's holiday. Hmm. I think he said <laughs> just a week's holiday. <laughs> Yeah, I've just sold a business, that kind. You sold your business? Yeah. What did you do? Um, I have, um, it was a milk delivery business, which I bought like a small part of my father. And he's still got the rest. And I've just, uh, like, I needed a break away from the industry. It's good. I didn't get a word of that. Yeah. <laughs> so, you know. Yeah, no, no, I know. So that's great. So you're a sexy milkman who doesn't work anymore. You're visiting America. And that's you're an right. American girl who... I'm going to college in Australia. You're going to college in Australia, right. And which part of Australia? Uh, Canberra. Canberra, that's right next door to Perth in many ways, except the other side of, what is it, like 3,000 miles away? Yeah, something like that, like 4,000 kilometres. 4,000 kilometres, we, yeah, we don't speak. 
I'm like, you got to get on board. You gotta no, get on board. no, no, no. Yeah. See, the decimal system, we tried that, and then we went, eh, ay caramba. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, sorry for cussing in front of you. Uh, so where are you, uh, where, where are you going to study in college? Uh, I'm studying at the Australian National University, and I'm studying astrophysics. Astrophysics? <laughs> 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 I suddenly feel old, sad, and stupid. <laughs> oh, wait, I've been feeling that for years now. <laughs> well, I, what I thought was maybe, uh, you know, when you get to Australia, maybe Abraham could show you around. He, you, have you ever been to Canberra? Yes, I have. It's yeah. your nation's capital. That's right. And one of the finest towns in Australia. <laughs> <laughs> I got into trouble with the Canberrans, or Canberronians. They get mad at me because Guy, Guy Pierce was here, who's an Australian, and he said that Canberra was a dump. I didn't say it, but I got into trouble. Well, it's pretty boring. It's just like... Don't say Canberra is a boring... They'll go crazy. <laughs> well, like, it's where the government's based. And, like, we all know what governments are like. They're, they can be pretty boring. <laughs> you should really have a show, really, I think. <laughs> should... Anyway, look, here's the thing. Um, we've got a special treat for you both. It's a commercial break. <laughs> Tap you on the shoulder, state your name for the folks at home. Uh, Tom Hanks. Tom Hanks. Hanks. <laughs> what do you do for a living, Tom? Uh, I am an actor. Actor, really? Yes. yes. Been in anything I might have seen? A couple, two, three things, probably. Hope so. Hope so. Doctor Who? <laughs> Not familiar with it. All right, then, all right. So, uh, Tom, why would you be here this evening? I, I've. Uh, I have no idea why you've uh, graced us with your presence. Why, why, why are you here, Tom? The tickets are free. Yes, there is that. <laughs> they are. So what you're saying is the actor thing is going not, not going that well, then? Not as good as I wish it could. Oh, now. Right. Okay. <laughs> So, uh, so uh, no special reason to be here? Uh, well, I would like to audition for the role of harmonica player in an upcoming film. Ah. Here's the thing, Tom. We don't really like to help actors here. I, saw, not... I saw the Michael Chiklis show, <laughs> yes. Right. All right. Tom, Tom you, I've got great news for you. If you can play the harmonica, Tom... Hanks. Hanks, Hanks, right. If you can play the harmonica, you win here the golden harmonica. It's a coveted and beautiful instrument and also a harmonica. Oh, beautiful. <laughs> Two and one. Yes. So, uh, do you have a harmonica you could audition? I have a harmonica you brought one right with here. you, right? A, if you uh, can play this, you will win the golden harmonica. He doesn't stand a chance. I only know how to play one song, and it has a little piece of dialogue at the end of it. I'll wait for the dialogue, and that'll be my cue. All right. This, I will now play the Boy Scout song from the Boy Scout public service announcement from the mid 1960s. <laughs> Imagine Boy Scouts swimming, camping, hiking, horseback riding, having a great time over this. Young couple, oh, you are a couple, are you? Yes. yes. What are your names? I'm Jake. No, no, no. You, you, you let her talk first. That's the deal. <laughs> My name's Brittany. And you are Jake. Brittany and Jake. Those adorable names, aren't they? <laughs> it's kind of like a, a show on the CW or something. <laughs> Brittany and Jake. <laughs> Where are you guys from? Columbus, Georgia. Georgia. You dating? 
Yeah. It's nice. Yes. Series? Hard to be a couple without dating. <laughs> I quite liked that kid earlier on, but I, <laughs> I'm changing my mind. So, uh, how's it going, the dating? It's going well, I think. Yeah, yeah. Ask her. <laughs> how's it going? You, uh, you happy with the way it's going? Well, yeah. <laughs> how's about I wander over here, and I'll stand off here with my buddy the horse, and if you got anything to do, get it done. So, uh, a little over a year ago, we started dating, and uh, it's been weird, and funny, and crazy, and a little ridiculous, but uh, flew all the way across the United States to uh, ask you if you'd marry me. Well, we learned that uh, Brittany and Jake, that's your names, isn't it? Mm -hmm. We're going to get married. This is lovely. And as it, please don't, no, wait, wait. Don't applaud that because they haven't got married yet. Uh, it's a tradition here at the show, Jeff and I, whenever there's a, a couple get married, we ask you to drink human blood from a coconut. If you're thinking of proposing to your intended on this show, stay Rocky. home. <laughs> when I tap you on the shoulder, please say your name for the folks at home. Okay, Sharon. Sharon. Ed. Sharon and Ed. You uh, related, Sharon and Ed? Yes. Yes. Married? Yes. Yes. 40 years, one month, and one day. Whoa, whoa, wait for the question, wait for the question. I know if you've been naughty or nice. <laughs> so, uh, where are you folks from? The North Pole. <laughs> where are you from? Virginia. Virginia, Virginia you say, eh? <laughs> uh, what part of Virginia? The North Pole part of Virginia. So, do you, uh, do you, uh, you've been married 41 years? 40, 40 years, one 40. month, and one day. Well, uh, congratulations, that's, uh, that's, that's quite a thing. <laughs> <laughs> hey, listen, I could have done that if I had people help me make toys. I, uh, do you, uh, do you get a lot of, uh, work this time of year? Lots of work. Ed. <laughs> <laughs> Lots of work. Yeah, yeah. Do you, uh, do you ever work in a mall this time of year? Once in a while, yes, I do. W what'd you do? <laughs> I sit in the chair and... People sit on my lap. <laughs> and you're okay with this? <laughs> and where is this mall? In, uh, in Virginia? It has been, yes. Virginia, Maryland. You have a mall that moves? <laughs> what? I've been a different... Virginia, right. Maryland, D.C. Mar I love Maryland. I got crabs there once. <laughs> So what are you doing in L.A. then, Mr. and Mrs.? Uh, what's your surname? Boyd. Bo Boyd. <laughs> <laughs> nice one. Nice one. Yeah. yeah. yeah so uh, what are you doing in L.A.? Uh, Visiting. an RV. You, oh, an RV? Yeah. Yes. <laughs> you guys going around America yeah. in an RV? Yes. Oh, that's great. Yeah. <laughs> I think I've been behind you guys yeah. quite a lot, actually. Yeah. <sighs> Good times. <laughs> so... Uh, Anything special coming up in the next week or two for you guys? Going to San Diego for Christmas. Good, good. <laughs> <laughs> hey, we're going to send you to a restaurant. Where are we sending them? Craig's. Craig's? Yeah. Uh, there's a restaurant called Craig's. Nothing to do with me. It's actually oh. good. Uh, uh, <laughs> no, it's good. It's a really good restaurant. And if you go there, they'll, uh, they'll give you... What would you like to eat? Anything. Do you, do you like... Do you enjoy meat? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yes. They got a ton of that there. Okay. Uh, <laughs> Uh, you like you like uh, fried potatoes cut up in little wedge shapes? Oh, yes. French fries! Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah you like those? Yeah, oh, they're good. All right then. Well, they uh, they probably got those too. <laughs> I know they have. Do you like uh, dessert? Yes. Do they have that too. Good. good. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> so would that classify as me being uh, good then? Nice, would you yeah. say? Nice is a word? Yeah. You're good. You're good. <laughs> I'm a whore. <laughs> It's beginning to look a lot like Christmas. <laughs> la, 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 la. Every year for how long is it now? Five years. Five years. Every year for five years now, these guys turn up the week before Christmas with their Christmas sweaters on. They sit in the audience and stare at me in a passive aggressive fashion <laughs> until I put them on the show. However, wasn't there one year when you kind of broke up and, and then there was a, like you were here and there was a, like a replacement sweater guy? Yeah, with a big mustache. Yeah, what was that about? I uh, can't grow a mustache. <laughs> so, like you guys, that, is that a, that's not really a sweater. You didn't throw yourself this, at it this year, man. This is not a sweater? Well, it's a zipper, cardigan Wait, thing. wait, wait. You're going to make fun of me and not him? Well, I'm not making fun. I'm just saying he, he looks more like he's got his... Do you know your, your beard is getting grey? That's how long we've oh, been doing yeah, this? Yeah. <laughs> Definitely. But you know what's the weird thing is, like, they turn up... Uh, every year, the sweater guys turn up, the regulars, clockwork. But this year, they brought sweater girlfriends. <laughs> And I'm like, well, the days of the sweater guys are doomed. <laughs> you guys are going to have to split up. Mm -hmm. I don't know about that. <laughs> well, look, the sweater girlfriends are here, and, you know, now that I've seen them, you guys are toast. It's all interchangeable. <laughs> no, it's not all interchangeable, oh, no. man. It's not, it's not the Late Late Show with the sweater guys, their girlfriends, and Craig Ferguson. It's just Crying. me. <laughs> so... I'm so Come on over, girls. Come on over, girls. <laughs> so, do you guys all live in the same house? Nope. Yes. <laughs> nope, yes. Who here is the meth supplier? <laughs> These are all my children. <laughs> we'll be right back, everybody. So wait for the folks. Wait for the folks. Uh... <laughs> Please state your name for the folks at home. Melanie. Melanie. Yep. Melanie what? Jade Polito. Oh, three names. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Do you want to ask me what I'm doing with this on my arm? Sure. What are you doing? Crying. With you. Fair enough. It's like that bit where uh, Sam Jackson in Pulp Fiction says all that mad stuff and then... Ay caramba! This is my version of it. <laughs> no, no, I'm not... Tootsie Fruitsie. So, um, what are you doing here, Melanie? I've heard from the warm-up comedian... <laughs> You've been here uh, 40 times? 44-ish. 44 44-ish 44 times? What do you mean, ish? Well, when you were testing out the new studio, I came to that the week before. Yeah, but I wasn't, I didn't do that. That was I, rehearsed I know, and I have this rule that I never do it. ish, ish. So. All right, okay. Who was, who was guest hosting then? Who was doing that? When ben the, Dukes. Ben Dukes? Ben Dukes has got a great country band, but he's no late night television host. <laughs> you did good, you did good. You know what? He could kick my ass, so let's just say he did. <laughs> ben Duke says, right, we should have Ben's band back on the show. <laughs> hey, hey. Do you guys know Ben? Yeah. Yeah. I've seen him around before. <laughs> I don't like the way this is going. Uh, anyway, look. Uh, why have you been here 44 times? Who hurt you? What went wrong in your life? I don't know if we have that kind of time. I don't know. I just, I just really like it. Here. I like you. I like that. <laughs> I like I like Chunky. I like Michael. I think everyone is interesting. So you hate the horse? I <laughs> know. Uh, I like the horse. <laughs> it never ceases to amaze me how sad things can be sometimes. <laughs> young woman with her whole life in front of her and she comes and hangs around in a basement with a creepy foreigner, a gay skeleton robot and a horse. <laughs> what would you like to do with your life? 
Well, I want to be a TV writer, and I have for many years. Oh! Oh! oh. We're out of time. We'll be right back to the show, everybody. We'll be right back. Well, we overran tonight, so we don't have any time for chit-chat. Let me just say, on behalf of uh, Tien and Lisa, Secretariat, Lesbian Row, and these two girls that annoyed me on Twitter. That's it. That's everybody, isn't it? Yeah, that's pretty much it. All right. Have a safe and happy flight, everybody. Good night. Good night.